so something sad is about to happen. YouTube is about to get rid of this lovely page right here, the classic YouTube Studio, all to replace it with the newly designed YouTube Studio. Personally, this is a very sad day for me, mainly because even though YouTube's old analytics didn't look as clean, it was way easier to navigate. But now we are at this awkward time where half of YouTube Studio's features will push you out to the old YouTube analytics page and it just doesn't really feel like they're ready to switch over. But hey, I guess YouTube does since recently they posted this. Basically 1% of their creators are switching over completely to the new YouTube studio design and it will gradually raise to 100%. So if you're interested in this, make sure you stick around because I'm going to be going over all the lovely things about the new YouTube studio and all the not so lovely things because there's actually a lot. So let's just take a look at this beautiful page for a minute and soak in how smoothly this ran. Ah, uh, I'm gonna miss you. Anyways, that is getting replaced by the new YouTube Studio which looks way better, but it's hard to find some of the old features that you're used to from the old previous build. I wish they just kind of reskinned the older YouTube Studio and made it look slightly more appealing versus completely redesigning it all. They could have even added some extra tabs for all their new features added, but no, rather than fixing all of our other bugs, say like this one here, they completely redesigned it. It seems great and all, but certain features just don't work smoothly like the blurring tool for example, does not seem to work whatsoever and I'm curious if it's because when you go to use this feature from YouTube Studio, it pushes you back to the original YouTube Studio to edit the blurs and it never seems to even save after waiting days for it to take action. And another annoying thing about YouTube Studio is how big the description tab is when you upload. Like I have huge descriptions in my videos and it'll only show about five lines, whereas the old version, I could expand that tab out and show almost my entire huge description. And then when you go to use their upload beta, the tags basically seem like an afterthought. If you actually look for the tag section, it's very hard to notice, and I almost forgot to add tags on several of my videos doing this, so I just switched over to the classic upload tool. I'm not looking forward to this change, and I really hope I'm not part of this 1% of people who are getting changed over this month, because I'm almost always clicking this annoying tab literally drives me insane and I have to click this like 10 times a day to access my old features but I guess that'll all be going bye bye soon <laughs> anyways. Well, if you're gonna miss classic YouTube studio then press that like button to pay respects. I'll see you guys on the next video and I guess that's only if you subscribe because if you didn't, well, goodbye forever. <laughs>